All right, what's up, guys? It's Kick, and today I'm coming to you guys with another Sony Vegas tutorial. Now, I'm just gonna get straight into this. I don't have like a long intro because pretty much everyone that's just clicked on this video wants to get straight into the tutorial, and um, that's what I'm gonna do here. So first off, I'm gonna show you guys an example. Now, keep in mind where I'm using this effect is really not the place where you should be using the effect. I'd recommend this maybe in a cinematic or something, but you know, just don't focus on my gameplay too much. Just focus on the effect that I'm showing. So here it is. Okay, so that's pretty much the effect. Now I'm gonna get into how to do this effect. So I'm gonna click here um, by where kind of like my first shot is. You can see by um, how the audio kind of goes up there. I'm gonna press S to split it. And then, you know, right here, I'll just split it again. And then now we have kind of this in the middle that um, we'll be having like the color effect. So drag these together again. Uh, you wanna come to HSL adjust. And I'm just gonna add a reset to none. And then what you do is come to animate, which is at the very bottom here. Let me just drag this up. Animates at the very bottom. Click this, and then halfway through, I'd say, or about halfway through, um, change this to the middle. And then at the end, change it back to um, just one. And pretty much what this will do is have this effect here. I'm gonna play it back for you guys. I have the audio muted, so. Um, you guys don't just hear random gunshots. Okay, so you can see kind of for that time period, the colors were changing. I would recommend using this maybe in like a cinematic or a motion track. It kind of depends on the song and the type of edit that you're doing. But, um, you know, this is just how you kind of do this effect. It does look very nice and you can do this with pretty much any Sony Vegas that's out. This is with 10, so... I know I'm going to get questions on which one this is, so this is 10, but you can do this with 12 or anything else, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys did enjoy this quick little tutorial, be sure to leave a like. I want to keep on doing these tutorials, and I want to keep on doing them quickly. I don't want people to be like watching this and just have five minutes of me talking without even showing you guys the effects. So if you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like. Other than that, it's been Kick. Peace.